Now, no new proposals regarding removing subsidies for packet cooking oil were presented to the Cabinet. Economy Minister Rafi Sirabli clarified that his earlier statement was about the government's ongoing effort to reduce leakage rather than abolishing subsidies. Rafizi said the implementation of government programs is regularly reviewed by the relevant ministries to minimize leakage, with a final decision to be made by the Domestic Trade and Cost of Living Ministry. Meanwhile, Deputy Domestic Trade and Cost of Living Minister Fuzia Saleh said the ministry is exploring mechanisms to track the leakage of subsidized cooking oil throughout the supply chain, from packaging to wholesalers, retailers and ultimately consumers. The ministry is considering using batch or serial numbers as a potential tracking method to curb the smuggling of subsidized cooking oil. Sebab bila barang itu dia tiris, dia pergi ke sempadan, seberang, ke negara jiran, bila kita tengok dekat negara jiran itu ada cap ABC contohnya. Tapi bila kita tengok cap ABC itu kita kena trace kepada repacker. Ya, tapi kita tak tahu daripada repacker dia dia tiris dekat repacker ataupun dia tiris dekat pemborong ataupun dia tiris dekat peruncit. Saranan Mas Gading ini ialah satu yang kita juga sedang tengok. Baru-baru ini saya pun tengok ada satu syarikat repacker buat perkara macam tu dan mungkin itu merupakan salah satu mekanisme yang boleh membantu kita untuk trace. Ya, untuk melihat di peringkat mana tirisnya. Sama ada di peringkat repacker ke, di peringkat pemborong ke, di peringkat peruncit. Ya, sebab, sebab mereka salah menyalahkan satu sama lain.